Hey you guys, it's Peter and welcome to my channel. Peter, that's me. Boom, 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 me. Boom, 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 boom. Bam, bam, and a bam, and a bam. Bam! Review stuff, and I am back for another review video. Today, I am at Dunkin' Donuts. I'm gonna review these omelet bites that have just come out. Everybody's talking about them. Are you excited? I know I am. I know I can't wait. Um, I actually got on the Google. I love the Google so much, don't you? You can find out anything you want to know on the Google. You can find out if snakes poop and everything. I did look that up one time, and they do. You can look it up. But anyway, I got on the Google to see um, if Dunkin' Donuts had any new things out because I was getting all these messages from people, and they were like, can you try the omelet bites? Can you try this? And I was like, what is this? Did uh, Dunkin' Donuts just come out with all these new things? So when I pulled it up, it took me right to their Twitter, and it says, totally yoked about our next uh, product launch. So I took it. Here, I'll show you. In true time here. Went right to their Twitter. Hit the Twitter. Go to the Twitter. There it goes. The Twitter. Okay. And it, they put out a tweet um, yesterday at 12.16 p.m. that says, totally yoked about our next product launch. Oh, my God. What I was not expecting, okay, was the mass bullying and hatred that Dunkin' Donuts received as a result of this. Somebody said, uh, sorry, did not enjoy your new omelet bites. Ate one, didn't bother eating the other. <laughs> Sad face, okay? Then somebody else responded and said, first you pulled the flatbread, and recently you got rid of the veggie egg white. Now you bring that back in these omelet bites? What you doing, Dunkin'? <laughs> <laughs> These are so funny. Um, somebody else said, Ha! I bet it has something to do with eggs because yoked was used instead of stoked. And marketing reports show that the target demographic loves dad puns. <laughs> okay? So then this person responded and said, Well, you are kind of right. And they put a whole thing up here of the screen at Dunkin' Donuts. So I'm going to tell you the new things that they have at Dunkin' Donuts for winter 22, 2022. The first, uh, it looks like a flyer maybe that they got in the mail or something because it's got Baskin Robbins on here too. Okay, the first thing they have is the omelet bites which is what I'm gonna try today. Then they have a new brown sugar oat ice latte made with oat milk, which I'm gonna try that here in the days to come. Then they have a stoop waffle donut. This is what it looks like. It's like a chocolate donut with a stoop waffle in the middle of it. I guess that's how you pronounce it, I don't know. Stroop waffle, <laughs> stoop waffle, <laughs> who cares, I'm stupid. Anyway, I'm stupid for you, oh my God. And then they have the brown sugar cookie cold brew cold foam. That actually sounds really good. So I will be trying that up here, okay? And um, yeah, so I'm gonna try the Dunkin' Donuts omelet bites. It says two omelet bites per order. Um, do not mix varieties. Always served warm, I think it says. Um, I don't know what kind they have. So let's go up here and let's see. Where's my wallet so I can pay for these? Um, I, I know people think that I just get all this stuff for free. <laughs> oh, you're a reviewer of the world. You get all these review things for free. Now, that's not how it is. So, I'm going to go through and I'm going to get uh, pay for my omelet bites. <laughs> of course, by the, uh, th there was not one person in line. And I decided to get up here and order my omelet bites when three cars go ahead of me. So, now on the winter over here, they, have, they also have a new winter brew at Dunkin' Donuts. Now, I have to tell you, you probably know this if you've been watching my videos lately. I've been making my coffee at home lately. So, here is, today I'm drinking the Starbucks Holiday Blend, and then I also have water right here. So, I um, am going to wait until I get up to the order place, and I will be back in two and two. That was quick. They're moving so fast. I wanted to read the sign right here. Cold sips that warm the soul. And then they have this right here. Do you see? New brown sugar cookie cold brew cold foam and the brown sugar oat latte made with oat milk. So I will be reviewing those and sometime this week I will be reviewing these. I don't know if it'll be tomorrow. It could be tomorrow. I don't know if it'll be, what is tomorrow, Thursday? I don't know if it'll be Friday. Tomorrow's trash day. I don't know if it'll be Friday, Saturday. So who knows? One of these days though. I know it's so exciting. Okay. Let's see. If I get up here and they tell me they don't have these on my bikes, I'm going to be better. Okay. Uh, we're going to get today. Um, can I get an order of the egg white and veggie omelet bites, please? Okay. 
Anything else? Nope, that's it. Alright, go for it. Okay, thank you. They look awfully good, don't they? I'm kind of excited about it. So they come with bacon and cheddar. That's one uh that's one of them that you can get. Or you can get the veggie and um what did I say? Egg whites, veggie and wet egg whites, which is like the vegetarian option to those. So, excited about that. I don't know, I didn't look and see how much they were. They are moving so quick through here. Okay, come on, come on Audi SUV. Get your order, I'll tell you what they're ordering in front. I know like me, some of you, like that's your favorite thing is to see what the people in front order. I'm gonna see what they're getting. It's early today, y'all. I just got done vlogging. It is 11.44 a.m. And I got done vlogging, and now I'm doing my Dunkin' Donuts uh, review. And then I'm gonna go home, and I'm gonna make some more videos, and light some candles, and the dogs and I are gonna run around, and I'm taking down all my Christmas stuff today, <laughs> okay? Like, that's my goal. Get the Christmas stuff down, and the Christmas trees need to come down. And uh, have you already taken yours down? You're like, yeah, Peter, we took it down two weeks ago. No, my God, I wanted to enjoy it as long as possible. I would leave my Christmas stuff up probably until, well, we even haven't really had our first snow yet, but I would love to like have a snow at the Christmas, you know, and just still imagine it's Christmas. <laughs> I don't think we're supposed to get any snow. I was talking in my vlog about how there's this whole winter storm going on, but like literally Indiana and Illinois, if you didn't know, we're right next to each other, kind of like this. Kind of like, I guess like this more. <laughs> but literally if we're like this, the storm comes like right and like the, over the top of us and under the bottom of us and just misses us. And I want a winter storm. I want some snow. I wanna sit inside, she just keeps on handing him bags and bags and bags of stuff. What did he get? Omelet bites and donuts and Stroop and waffles and all kinds of stuff. How are you doing? Good, how are you? Good. Can I get a receipt please? Yeah, Thank you. Thank you. There, I did my paperwork for the day. <laughs> Thank you, you too. She was so friendly, wasn't she? They are like business in there. They like mean business. Okay. Let's go over here. We're gonna try these egg white things. I'm not super hungry, so I don't know how much of it I'm gonna eat, but. Well, enough to taste it, that's for sure. <laughs> okay, are you ready? My napkins. Oh, they're big. Did I review these already? No, I couldn't have, they just came out. Oh, they look like little bagels or something. Okay. They don't really look that good, I have to just tell you, okay? They look like they got Fruit Loops baked inside of them or something like that. I guess it's the veggie part of it, but they don't really look that great. Ugh, they're greasy. Do you see how they look like omelets? Or I mean like bagels. Ah! Look how greasy they are. Can you see that? They are so greasy, you guys. I think they should have put a fork in here. That would have made this easier. Okay, let's try these. They're not horrible. Now, every Sunday, I get an omelet at Cafe Patashu in Indianapolis. Oh my God, I get the omelet you can't um, refuse. But I don't get bacon in it. I get the bacon taken out of it. And it's potatoes, white cheddar, sour cream, and then I add uh, herb cream cheese and uh, horseradish. It's so good. So I know a good omelet, okay? This is okay. Um, a lot of people like online are saying they don't like these. They're not that bad. I mean, they really aren't. It needs a little something like salt or pepper or, or maybe some uh, hot sauce or flavor. Maybe some flavor would do something, you know. 
This is what they look like up close. They're super, super greasy, you guys. I don't think they're that bad. Honestly, I don't. I mean, for like a healthier breakfast, I don't know how, much, how many calories and stuff they have in them. But I mean, how bad could they be with egg whites and veggies and stuff in them? I don't think they could be that bad. <clears throat> oh, I didn't even look. I'll tell you how much they are. Hold on a second. Where's my receipt? That's why I got the receipt. 502! Oh my God! You can get your two Arby's roast beef sandwiches for that! Oh my God! No, ma'am. Uh-uh. That is so expensive. You get your full breakfast at Denny's for that. No, they're not worth 502, not at all, okay? But they're not bad, like, for a healthier breakfast in the morning if you're hungry and you need something with your coffee or something like that. I mean, I give them a four out of five. They're not, like, the best things in the entire world, but I don't think they're bad. This is the thing. I think this is kind of cute, this little Dunkin' Donuts thing it comes with. Um, the thing is that Dunkin' Donuts comes up with all of these new items on a regular basis, which I really, really like, whereas Starbucks comes up with, like, holiday drinks and the pumpkin spice latte, and at this point, like, come up with something else, you know what I mean? Other than a new cake pop, who'd care? So, yeah, I'm impressed with these. These are not bad. I give it a four out of five. So, anyway, let me know if you tried these. Have you tried any of the new things at Dunkin' Donuts? I'm going to be trying them, so, other than the omelet buys. Let me know. I want to hold this up so bad and be like, Hi, I see you. How are you? I see you. <laughs> that's that's going to be my thumbnail. Anyway, I love you guys, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.